Hello friends, prepared suburbanite here. Well, the wife and I have got a terrific opportunity, finally, to purchase our very own bug out location. We stumbled on this um, just browsing through some real estate listings on the internet and realized that this was near perfect location. Once we uh, kind of figured out exactly where it was, we got in the car, drove up there, and started taking a look around the, uh, around the area. And it took us a while to find this place, but we finally did locate it. It's uh, um, near a lake that's used for the closest city's reservoir. It's about six miles outside of town. The property itself is about 4.05 plus or minus acres, and it's located um, way off grid. Best I can tell, and we're still investigating, best I can tell there isn't any electric service into this area. There isn't any well on the property. The property has been surveyed, and there are um, probably 11 lots that range from three to seven acres in this uh, particular area that the owner has decided to, to break up into lots and sell it off. Um, the story is that they're from out of town. They purchased this tract of land a number of years ago. They're aging and it's time now for them to, to sell it off and the best that they could do would be to break it up into four and five acre lots and uh, sell it off. There is a gravel road that runs through the property. Well, not, not actually through it, but um, the bounder, uh, it's a boundary to the, to the property itself and runs um, in a horseshoe shape all the way around the uh, property around the hillside and then back to a uh, back to a junction and that junctions about four miles off the road the, the secondary road that it's on which is off kind of a primary highway that leads out of town we're pretty excited about it we've been in touch with a uh, local realtor and she's uh, investigating some of the uh, details right now the price is absolutely phenomenal. Our plan would be, um, if everything checks out, and we've got good clear titles and all those kinds of horrible things that you got to go through when you're buying property, if everything does check out, we're going to be making an offer on this within the next uh, 10 days to two weeks or so. That's the plan right now. The overall plan would be um, eventually, and maybe before uh, the end of this fall, would be to get in maybe a 12 by 12 storage shed um, cabin kind of a thing, erected on the land, um, use, the, use the cabin as a um, rain catchment device and uh, put in a 275 gallon water tote there so that we'd have uh, some supply of water because there is no well and there is no stream or river or anything. The lake itself is probably uh, three quarters of a mile to a mile away. So it's a little bit too far to go get water to walk and then, then try to drag it all back. So uh, that's kind of the plan right now. Um, we'll keep you posted. We'll keep you informed on our progress. Um, stay tuned and if you like what you see um, I've got some still shots that are going to be coming up here in a second if you like what you say give us a thumbs up and please subscribe when you can prepared suburbanite out